Hi, this is Julia Easton, and this is day two video of the video challenge. Yesterday I closed with uh, the question, which is actually today's question, which I came up with for the video challenge, which is what gifts are you not sharing with the world because um, you don't feel like that it's perfect or good enough to share with people. I'm really good at sharing a lot of things. I did a series of poems, 200 poems I shared, one per day. Uh, I will be having launched my first poetry book on the 21st of this month. Um, and I'm now doing a Create Every Day series, and I think today is day 19 of that. However, there's one thing that um, I have been really stalling on, and that is uh, recording uh, my first album with with Michael, my musical partner, business partner, soulmate. Um, and there are many good reasons that we've put off recording, but I know that it is very true that when things are really important, you make time for them. And we even created an accountability team of 21 wonderful people to help hold us account accountable for recording this album. Um, and we still have been putting it off. There have been times we've come into the studio really excited and had some technical problems and couldn't get mics to work. Um, but we, we know what to do now to narrow down what's going on, and we've definitely got a hardware issue going on. So we got to figure out where the... We're in the system that's not working. But there's something bigger going on here, for me, at least. Um, it's been me that's been doing more delaying than Michael. And I had uh, some fear of su success stuff going on for a while, um, kind of a fear of shining too brightly thing. Um, and Pam Ragland helped me with that last fall, got that knocked out. So the past few days I've really been thinking a lot on what else is holding me back from this. And I think a lot of it is tied to not feeling really confident about my singing voice sometimes. Um, when I was, I, I have memories of being a teenager and riding in the car with my sister and stepsisters and my mom and stepdad and singing songs for them and having them laugh at me. Um, I have memories of that are really painful still. My first husband when I was very young, way too young to get married, I was um, 21 when we got married. And it didn't last very long. But um, he told me that I couldn't sing and I shouldn't even try. And um, that really is stuck in there somewhere. I've got to find a way to push through this. Um, it's weird. I can go out to an open mic poetry reading and sing completely a cappella songs that are not meant to be a cappella. I, I call it singing naked. I'm not actually naked, but it's like the this the song is meant to have clothes of instruments around it. And so I'm singing it naked with just my voice. I can do that and I can be cool with that. But for some reason recording my music for the whole freeing world to hear on some level scares the crap out of me. And um, this is something that I have got to find a way to just kick it in the rear end and get over it. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's the big thing that I have been holding back on. And... Uh, I, uh, screen just went dim. Um, so, 
uh, I'll probably do some stuff in this challenge to help with that. And I probably won't say anything more about that because I haven't really decided exactly what or how I'm going to do that. But um, that's what my thing is and I'm not going to keep letting that happen. It's just not okay. So I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.